Mpika District has seen an increase in the number of learners reporting back to school following the implementation of the free education policy. This has also resulted in an increased demand for desks, prompting the local authority to allocate resources for the procurement of desks in various schools. <laughs> Mpika District Education Board Secretary narrates how the education sector has benefited from the increased CDF allocation in the district. 3,500. Because the council felt they couldn't manage to procure at a go all the 7,000 desks. So the local authority then decided to apportion it into two uh, procurement processes. So, so far we are receiving, the process of receiving the first batch of 3,500 is underway. A lot of schools have gotten the desks. Meanwhile, the Mpika Town Council procured earth moving equipment worth over 5 million kwacha and is already working on roads that require attention. We've managed to um, grade about uh, 52 kilometers of uh, both township roads and uh, feeder roads in the district. Um, we started with uh, Kamwanya Ward, then later our contractor, um, local engineers here at the council moved to, um, to Kamwanya and also other wards that, um, that uh, had their roads not in a good shape. The council has also assured Mpika residents that all roads that require rehabilitation will be worked on in the shortest possible time. Wilson Mulinda, ZNBC News, Mpika District, Muchinga Province.